Out with the old and in with the new. A homeowner in Beaumont is the first to have her house torn down as part of a state program. It's helping homeowners rebuild after Harvey. 12 News reporter Jordan Foster found out how it works. The walls came crashing down. The only thing left here, the memories, good and bad. It's been a long journey. Monday morning, Betty Jolovet and her family watched as their home that was damaged during Harvey was crushed to make way for something new. It's like a load was just lifted off of me and I feel light as a feather. <laughs> She's the first to see results from the Texas Homeowner Assistance Program. It uses federal money to help families repair and rebuild homes affected by Harvey. This is for homeowners whose homes were damaged or destroyed in the storm. The state received $1.3 billion, and Southeast Texas will see a bunch of that. Uh, this is one of the most impacted areas, so we set aside more than a quarter of that available funds uh, for this area. Steve Mataro owns DSW Homes and is heading this project. He says the Joliet family's new home will be built to withstand future storms. This house will be raised up out of the future floodplain mm -hmm. by a minimum of two feet. The new house will be built fast. 20 days from now, Betty will be handed the keys to her new place. Her message to the 2,000 other applicants for the program, good things come to those who wait. The proof is in the pudding. In Beaumont, Jordan Foster, 12 News. Well, it's not too late to apply for the homeowner assistance program. There will be two sign up events this weekend, one at the John Davis Community Center in Beaumont starting at 10 a.m. and another at Vider City Hall at 10 as well. And if you aren't able to make either event this weekend, you can always head over to their website, recovery.texas.gov.